We go thank God for this kind of mercy. Watch it. Watch my pocket. And since five o'clock, my shoes on my foot, it's soaking wet still. If I take it off, it's quickly so. Look why I have my pocket. 40 something dollars since five o'clock this morning. Yeah. That ain't right. Yeah. Me need nothing. I drink a cup of coffee alone for the morning. Nobody Watch my face. Needs, Hard. Just one of the many vendors organizing over the increase in rent on the San Juan public market. According to attorney Gerald Ramdeen, based on the San Juan Lavender bylaws, the minimum cost for the rental of a stall for a vendor to ply their goods are about $40, while the maximum is $100 per month. And this, Ramdeen said, is a clear breach as vendors have been informed that their rent will increase in some cases up to $600 to $1,600. Ramdeen said on August 2nd he wrote to the corporation chairman, Anthony Robert, seeking answers. Has been charging the sour market, public vendors market, the vendors of the sour public market, $800, $400 and threatening to charge them $1,600 to sell in the market. So what we have done is that we've given Mr. Robert seven days. The attorney said should they not get a response in a satisfactory time, they will take the matter to court. We have one thing for all the vendors here to use, and it don't can open. It will let open, no water in the toilet. He must tell us and tell the vendors when the council is going to pay back all the rent that has been paid over what the law prescribes. And if Mr. Roberts does not prepare to do that within seven days, the vendors and I are prepared to go to court and bring a constitutional motion. In addition to increased rent, the vendors said the market is in need of infrastructural improvements. Sherilyn Lewis, TTT News.